Hello and welcome to Retro Roulette, the show that asks if a lightning bolt hits the back of a train, how long until the bolt travels to the front and kills the driver? I'm your host, Michael Riley. With me is Dane Forgione. Well, it depends on how long the train is. And uh, Billy Carter's around here somewhere. You know what it also depends on? If the driver's a good conductor. Mm. Mm. You're yes. so clever. Quiet. Spinning the wheel, we're playing the 64. Of course it would land on Billy's Choice when he's not in the room. Billy's Choice. <laughs> Hi, I'm Billy, and I'm fat. So we're going to wait a second for Billy to come back. Because <laughs> it landed on Billy's Choice. God damn it, Billy. Well, I'll tell you what. I think I know what Billy's Choice would have been, so I'm just going to go ahead and hit it. Oh, Lord, this time, that's not what I was going to pick, you asshole. I guarantee this is what he would have picked. Oh. Oh. Yeah. <sighs> All right. Oh. Even though this game is really bad. It is. I feel like we played... Something like, didn't we play this game, I thought? Uh, I don't think so. There was another, what was the WCW game we played? That yeah. wasn't, uh, that wasn't Aki. Uh, Nitro. Oh, okay, then, no, we didn't play this game. Oh, more wrestling! Well, we landed so on... We actually landed on Billy's Choice, but you weren't in the room, so we picked the game we thought you would have picked. I would have picked this, yeah. Yeah. So. You know me too well. Okay. All right, then I, then I stand corrected. All right, Dane, what did you think I would have picked? Um, you know, I kind of thought you would have picked maybe Earthworm Jim. I probably would have picked that too, either one of these two. But best to get this out of the way. Oh, oh, oh no! What the fuck? What's happening here? I don't know. Look at DDP's arm! No! He's got a penis coming out of his arm. <laughs> oh my oh, lord! Oh, oh, oh. I didn't. I just noticed that. Oh my god! Look at oh. his arm, dick. Self oh, high five, is... indeed. Oh god, this is terrible. No! <laughs> penis nipple. <laughs> <laughs> I'm Booker T and I got oh. a pointy thigh. Hi, hi, I'm alive. Buff's alright. Conan, Conan has something sticking out of his side. Eight o'clock. Oh my god! <laughs> Ernest the Cat. No! No, Kurt. No. Uh, uh, big old boner. Kurt Henning, why? Perfect boner. Barry Wyndham, your nipple. What? <laughs> your titty is everywhere. <laughs> well, no, Bobby Duncan Jr. has a head wound. <laughs> let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see Bobby Duncan Jr. Oh, God. <laughs> Norman Smiley's <laughs> ass. What the fuck? <laughs> Norman Smiley's got a dump truck ass. That's a big wiggle, all right. <laughs> oh, God. How can this get any worse? No, not Go. Buddy Lee Parker! <laughs> oh, Bobby. Bobby Blaze, Bobby. All right. I don't even know. We got Hor ah. Horace, Scott Norton, Stevie Ray, and Eric Bischoff. Interesting bitch yeah. face. Oh, no. Scott Steiner. I am the Scott big, Steiner. bad, booty daddy. Nash's torn quad. Look at it. <laughs> oh my God, Scott Hall. <laughs> hey, Chico, what's the matter with me, Chico? Look at my tits. <laughs> Disco Inferno is being picked up with chopsticks, apparently. <laughs> when was he was in the Wolfpack? I, uh huh. Yeah. Oh, oh Horseman, nice. All right. Uh huh. <laughs> Uh, <laughs> well, 
He might as well be a jumbled mess of pixels. <coughs> that explains why he was able to murder so easy. Look at his arm. <laughs> Plastic man! Oh. Oh my god! Oh. <laughs> Ray! Oh no! <laughs> Why? Oh. Eddie Rare looks okay. Hoovy's on the juice. Chris Jericho's forearm is kind of lump. <laughs> big old that was yeah. this, this was the last WCW game he was in. Yep. Chavo's all sorts of fucked up. Park is alright. Hey, oh. there's my main man, the Parker. Yeah. Hello, here's Alex Wright. Because I asked, his stomach is bloated. Lash LaRue is being handled with chopsticks. Liz Mark Jr. Ooh. Oh. Hey, like listen. He, he just looks like a meat puppet. <laughs> Who are you to doubt El Dandy? Fair. <laughs> hardcore. <clears throat> Why is Mean whoa, Gene in hardcore? Hold on, hold on a second. Hold on. <laughs> Why I is... refuse to believe Mean Gene Oakland was not hardcore. Come on. Have you seen his interviews? His uncensored ones? <laughs> hey, how about your fucking pick a... Ooh, Saturn. Oh, my God. Saturn. His Where's legs... Your... Saturn, half your, your, your leg legs? is missing. <laughs> oh. I just have... When... <laughs> By the time we get to the actual match, we're going to run out of time. Bam, bam, big, bam, bam, bam's got an oh. axe wound in his chest. Canyon's alright. Oh, um, baby, I'm thinking about Oh, it my here. God. Sonny oh, Ono is in hardcore? Why? <laughs> okay, Doug Dellinger, Doug? I get. Where's Doug Dellinger? He's not even He's there. Not even there. Oh, there he is. There he is. Hey, I'm gonna run out of the run. Junior, baby. Oh, and then there's created wrestlers, which I don't have. So. Yeah. Uh, let's go. Oh, you can rotate the wrestler, too. Ooh, weird. All right, I'm going to go back to hardcore, and I'm going to pick Raven. And then let's pick... Oh, now they look normal. Oh, mean, sort of. Mean Gene, Sonny Ono, and Doug Dillinger. All right, let's play a match. <sighs> Please wait. It's a cartridge. This is oh, oh my God! There, there are medieval, medieval times with that uh, backdrop here. <laughs> WCW Saturday Night. Is there any announcers in this game? Yeah, uh, sounds like me, Mean Gene is doing the announcing, and then Tony Schiavone is doing commentary. Yeah, Mean Gene's doing the ring announcing. So he just introduced himself there. Okay, Sonny Ono did not do that. How do you know? <laughs> you don't watch it all the time. Watch. What about when he wasn't on camera? He could have done that off camera. Sure. I'll be right back, guys. I got a, I got a call coming in. <laughs> I'll be right back, guys. I just realized how shitty this game is. I'll be back after this game. Is nice set of <laughs> yeah, okay, well, bye. Bye, Billy. He did say he had a call coming in. True. Whoa. Yikes. Boy, by golly, I tell you, this is some scintillating game. I know. Play. Game. Play. What's going on here? Yeah, mm-hmm. Yeah, mm-hmm. Doug Dillinger, her Karana, yep, mm-hmm. He yep, totally did totally that. totally did that. <clears throat> yep. No doubt about it. Mm, yep, see, did it again. I think it's only Tony Schiavone on commentary too. So like no no Mark Madden which is probably good. Larry Zabisco, no Larry Zabisco. No. I'm out. 
Well, that's fine because that means we can just sit here and watch the rest of this match. No, Bobby Heenan. Oh, I'll see you, Sonny Ono. What? Um. Fucking I'm, I'm, excuse I'm, I'm, me? Um, 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 I'm um. How? 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 How did that happen? Because Doug Dillinger went through the ropes. So did Mean Gene. They both landed on the floor at the same time. But they didn't. You, you, you proud of yourself? You proud of yourself that you, you, you picked this game for Billy? No, he picked it too. He clearly uh. said that he picked it. Yeesh. Okay, well, um, let's do... I wish there was like a... It says Battle Royal, but I wish it was like a... Uh, Royal Rumble. Unfortunately, it's not. <clears throat> Here, I'll just do Quick Start, and we'll see. Okay. I thought it we'll would say wrestlers randomly as well. Old Burger. Um... Let me see if there's a random button here. I'm waiting for it to show up on the thing. Hello, Billy. Again. Yeah. You know, Billy, you miss me and Gene winning a battle royal. Yeah. In the most fucking weird way possible. Sorry about that, guys. I had to take a call. Sorry about that, guys. I had to take a shit. It was work-related. Sorry. They asked yeah, me how much wood today? could a woodchuck no. chuck if a woodchuck could chuck wood. They asked me, do you want to come in today? No. If I wanted to come in today, I'd be off. there. Yeah, it's my day off. I ain't going in. Eric, bitch off. I have no idea what match this is because I just hit quick start. So, oh, Jesus. It's a chicken McNuggets. It's a chicken McNuggets. Booger P. Oh my god. Also, Billy, what I know from this gameplay, Doug Dillinger, he does he did her for runs. Yes. Mm -hmm. <laughs> and then he and Mean Gene went through the ropes, landed on the floor at the same time, and somehow only Doug Dillinger got eliminated and Mean Gene won the match. Yeah. Boy, game of the fucking year right here, folks. Right? It's the chicken McNuggets. It's the chicken McNuggets. Chucky, Chucky, quack, quack. Let's go, Booker T. Took her B. This is sheer mayhem. It's the name of the game. Yes, we get it. It's Booger P. And the MGs. Oh! On the ramp. Is this all computer? No, I'm playing. You can't have an all computer in this game. Are you Bischoff? I am Bischoff. Uh, you're, you're bitch tall? Yes. Where, where, where did I go? Um, oh, this is one disgusting looking bathroom. Tis. Can I pick that up? Hey, everyone, you know what would be a great game? If you played a wrestling game, but you were only backstage. We'll call it Backstage Assault. 
this was the first game to ever do a backstage anything. How do, how do I pick that up? Oh, I got it. Finish him. How do I do that? Don't know. How do I pin? I guess I don't. Oh! What an unbelievable move! He got a urinal to the face. Uh, Would love to know how to pin, though. I think you could only do it in the ring. Oh, that's fair. Take a big nugget. Take a big motherfucking nuggets. Boy, this um, this would be a main event anywhere in uh, <laughs> in, Bots in Botswana. In Botswana, yeah. Can't climb the ropes? All right. Fuck it. Why are we whispering? I don't know. Emily, do you have a secret to tell? Guess we'll never know. Nope. I still don't know how to pin someone, though. Oh, you're giving him a fucking Terry Funk spinning toe hold of yep. hideous discomfort. Oh, there we go. Oh. What the f What the fuck? Hold on. <laughs> Did I just have a fucking stroke? <laughs> um, I'm... You you saw that too, didn't you? I I threw him one direction yeah. and he went one different direction and then I back body dropped him somehow without ever being anywhere near him. I I I, I saw it. I'm just had a fucking loss for words. Oh Christ. I uh, I don't I'm starting to suspect this game is really bad. Possible? Please be it. Hey, I won. Thoughts on WCW Mayhem, Dane? Um, that was fucking terrible. I mean, Look at Booker T no selling me. <laughs> where else can we see Doug Dellinger and Mean Gene Oakland exit the ring at the same time through the ropes? And somehow, Mean Gene wins it. Battle Royale. <laughs> Only in this game, I guess. Uh, yeah. Billy. It's better on the PlayStation. Yeah, <laughs> a polished turd is still a turd. Um, it's true. Yeah, this game is bad.
Um, and honestly, it's I think it was one of the last, if not the last, WCW game besides Backstage Assault. And it shows. It's terrible. Losing the uh, losing Aki to WWE did not do them any favors. Uh, scores out of ten, Dane. One. Billy. Two. I'll give it a one. All right, here we go. I'm gonna spin the wheel again and see what we get. Spare us suck. Well. Oh. South Park, Love Shack. It's a little old place where we can get we together. Can get Mm -hmm. Love Shack, baby. Chef, love Shack. Chef's love Shack. Which was basically just South Park's version of Marriage Party. Basically. Simultaneous loving. Oh, Isaac Hayes. You deserve far better. <laughs> no shit. And welcome to the show. Before we get started, we're going to need your help. Please press your button to join in. Remember, folks, until Stick of Truth came out. This was mostly, the last South Park game. <laughs> well, there was mostly very bad South Park games. Who should I be? I don't give a flying fuck. No whammies. Guess I'm Eric Cartman. Choose the number of rounds. Sure, why not? We're not gonna get to all of them anyway, probably. South Park Cable Access welcomes you to Chef's Love Shack. Wow, Eric's in a Eric's there all by himself. The show where young, vivacious, uninhibited swimsuit models compete for the chance to spend a romantic weekend with our host. Due to the lack of young, vivacious, uninhibited swimsuit models, today's show will feature youngsters from South Park Elementary. And now, won't you mm -hmm. be your host? Uh, does that mean that, that mean Eric Cartman's still going to have to spend a vivacious weekend with Chef? That's what I was about to say. Hold on a second. Hello, to Chef's Love That's, uh, that ain't no good. Lovely lady number one is Eric Cartman. It. Roy, why the hell can't we ever get lovely lady? Sorry, Chef. The cheerleading squad has practice today. All right. Come on, children. Here we go. What category will it be, Eric? Uh, let's do sucks or Canadian. For Canadian, yeah. So I would have that one. In Quebec, they're not only Canadian, their official language is French. French. Why can't I select? I couldn't select. What category would it be, Eric? Do that one, Mighty Hermaphrodite. This is basically You Don't Know Jack, only really terrible. Alright, let's jump straight into a gameplay round. Oh, there is some Mario Party in this, though. I was going to say, this is if Mario Party and You Don't Know Jack had a baby, and the baby died, it would be Chef's Love Shack. And then he had to adopt a mentally uh, disabled child. Yeah, this would be the game. This is Donkey Kong. It is. <laughs> Shit. <laughs> well, at least I'm first. Man, oh man. That was very exciting. What category would it be, Eric? Uh, oh. a form of herpes. Okay. Holy Dungeons and Dragons. Under a microscope, the herpes virus looks like... 
I guess an eight-sided die. I can't select though. What the Don't fuck? Buzz in? All right, let's jump straight into a game. I, I no. think you have to buzz in first. I I hit A, but it acted like I picked the wrong answer. This. Oh god, this game sucks. Read the instructions carefully. Your controls are displayed beneath your character. Left hand, right hand. I mean, this isn't as fun with only one person. Right. It would probably be better with more than one. Mm-hmm. You couldn't get the complete fours in here? Nope. Wouldn't let me do that. I... I see, I see. Aliens, assholes, and able anal probes. That's the name of my punk band. How many sphincters does the human body have? How do you select? See, too long. What the hell's going on with this game? Yeah, I don't know how to select. Could it be the uh, three buttons that you have to select? You know, cheap trick. Yellow buttons. Wait. Oh, I do have to buzz in. Shit. That's what. Oh. Well. For some reason, it didn't do it before, and I don't know why. Lesbian role models. Alan DeGeneres. That sounds like it's double down time. Place your bet. Now for the question. Lesbian role models hate this company. The world leader in ladies' razors. Uh, um, chic. Uh, nope. I, it was probably Gillette, I would suspect. Asses in space. <laughs> if you're not sure how to play the Wipe the asses out. Your controls are displayed beneath your character. Great. Let's see who's got the skills for this game. Asses in space. Asteroids. <laughs> I'm Terrence and or Philip. I can't, I don't know which. I can't tell from this far away. Ouch. Ouch. Okay. Uh, cool. <laughs> cool. Welcome back, Jurgen. That was a great game. What category would it be, Eric? Uh, limeys and tea bags and frogs. Oh my. <laughs> oh. We don't afford two of this nest. Pump your button and watch the wheel go. You kids are sure to All right, let's jump straight into it. Oh boy. Gonna play Avalanche. Avalanche. Whoa, Black Betty. Avalanche. Avalanche. Oh, Black Betty. Avalanche. Okay. Oops. Avalanche. Whoops. Uh, okay. I guess you're going to get first place. Watch. Because <laughs> I'm the only one playing. Man, oh man. Yep. What category would it be, eh? Uh, sticks and twigs. Use Mr. Twig to find water and he becomes a... 
Divining Rod. Yeah. All right, get there. What category would it be, Eric? Uh, chili con carnies. I'd like to whack a defenseless curry Eric. animal. Which one is featured in most carnival arcades? I think it's that one. Say what? A mole. Whack a mole. Nice. Let's see here. It's chicken lover. Um. Read the instructions carefully. Your controls are displayed beneath your character. It's time for a gameplay round. Okay. I think I don't know if I've kept my eye on him. Maybe. Better make sure. Chicken lover is gonna start loving some chickens if you count wrong. Nope, I was wrong. Uh oh. Oh. Oh my god. Oh my word. Uh, Robert Smith kicking ass. Kicking me kicking ass works up an appetite. Robert Smith enjoys cured meat because it's so... I don't know. It's oh. so good. Oh my god. Uh, what category would it be, Eric? Uh, Mighty Hermaphrodite. <laughs> All human embryos practically are practically male and female to this week of gestation when nuts do or don't develop. I don't know. Nope. Not the sixth. What category would it be, Eric? Aliens, assholes, and anal probes. Which would an earthbound proctologist use to probe Cartman? A speculum. Nope. His finger. Clearly. Whack a zombie. All right. If you're not sure how to play the game, check the instructions. Your controls are displayed beneath your character. It's many game time. All right. It's really is not that tif di that difficult. Oh, you're losing points because you're killing non-zombies. Oh, I see. Whoops. So I gotta pay attention. I oh, don't know. Well, at least I ended up on the positive side. Yeah. Cartman has a fat ass. Uh, famous gay cowboys. <laughs> Bareback Brock oh, Roddy sounds gay, but it's a real rodeo event. Which of the following isn't? Uh, barrel racing? Well, apparently it's saddle bucking. Oh. Yeah, uh, barrel racing is a real event. People who eat people. People who eat people, why should it be? That sounds like it's double down time. Oh, alright. How much are you going to bet today, kid? Yeah. Now, for the question. Alright. He brought us the man-eating zombies of Night of the Living Dead. George Romero. Yep. Well, all right. <laughs> what category would it be, Eric? Not uh, John Romero. Okay, sirrah, sirrah. Whatever will pee, will pee. Which group had a hit with mbop, mm okay? Hanson, okay? The children of the corn. Very good. <laughs> Let's jump straight into a gameplay round. Let's go do gameplay round. Do a bit, a bit, a bit, a bit. Scuzzlebutt. Aw, oh, Stampede. 
empty. Yeah, you bet. Haul ass and stay ahead of the herd. It's time for a gameplay round. For sure. Jimbo, what are you doing, man? Carmen, no. Oh. I, I got pretty far. And then he died. And then he died. The end of. Uh, the 1991 Denver Broncos. What's the name of the Broncos home field? Mile High Stadium. It's gotta be this one. Yep. Yeah. Though no, it would be interesting if it was called Ewok Village. The P in pool. Yeah, Elmo has something to say about that. <laughs> The peas. There's none left. You going to bet today, kid? Oh my God! I can finish <laughs> the five. All right. No, Carmen, don't do it. Ugh. Which organ makes urine? Uh, the kidneys. Did that say the who, -who dilly? <laughs> Sticky situations. Kenny's corpse gets pumped full of thick, gummy fluid. Now, that's what I call embalming. Embalming. Talk about a situation. That's what I call necrophilia. <laughs> Talk about a sticky situation. <laughs> Soda shake. All right. This actually, this game is not is, is kind of fun, but I think it would be more fun with more people. Yeah. Let's see who's got the skills for this game. I mean, if we're going to start doing our... Uh, yeah, Dane, go ahead and give me your thoughts on Chef's Love Shack. I, I feel like I might have underestimated this game. Because I remember it being really, really, really bad. Um, But I feel like with more people this game would be inoffensive at best i mean like i said it's like if if you don't know jack and mario party had a baby so yep and then it was yeah. and then it was coded in south park mm -hmm. i mean is this game great not no. not by a long shot is it as bad as i remember it no. Uh, Billy. It, you know, if you like trivia games and little mini games, you'll probably like this game. The controls for the mini games actually look like they're competent. Um, but it's it's mediocre at best. I could see where people, when they got this game, you know, South Park, they were expecting something more. But it was basically a South Park budget title. Party games weren't the big thing at the time until Mario Party came out. I mean, Mario Party came but, out long before this. That's why this came out. Well, like I said, it was a Mario Party where everybody freaking just loved that game. And it, this this was yeah, mediocre at best. Yeah, a lot of the mini games they do seem a little generic uh, and a little like unimaginative at times, but it's still fun. I mean, it I I I could imagine this being kind of fun with with more than one person. Scores out of ten, Dane. Four. Billy. I'll give it a four. I will give it a five. All right, one last game this episode. Let's find out what it be now. Ah, plus one diarrhea card. We have four now. Plus one diarrhea card. Awesome. Let's spin one more time. Interesting. Okay. I've been curious about this game since I saw it show up on the wheel. The Transformer. Oh, Lord. I know what this is. What yep. Yes. I mean, what else could it possibly be? Right. 
It's uh, Beast Wars. It's obviously Ogre Battle. <laughs> yeah. Obviously, it's Street Fighter Clone Wars. Uh, why is it default on very hard? I'll do easy. Is this a fighting game? Uh, I don't know. Never played it. Seems like a fighting game. Optimus Primal, Rat Trap, Cheetor, Eraser, Megatron, Tarantulas, Waspinator, and Terrorosaur. I guess, I'll, I guess I'll go Optimus Primal. Well, that's just prime. Thank you, Gary Chalk. <laughs> You are on Robot Chicken. It is a fighting game. Oh, it's it's like DBZ. I get it. Oh, Optimus Primal. Okay. I was wondering why he was bouncing around like a fucking ape. But now I know why. Because he is an idiot. No, I'm just kidding. Yeah, this is a pretty crazy. Oh, God. Rat trap. Mm -hmm. face. Close the door. Cheese dip. Boom. I won. Ready. Fight. <laughs> that was easy. Boy, you win. Battle in the wastelands. Tarantulas. Oh. Ready. Fight. Tarantulas are just <laughs> fucking missiles at you. Yep. He sure that. was. Ooh. Oh. Ba -da -ba 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 -ba. Ooh, no fatalities. Uh. Not sure you can actually kill a Decepticon. It's a robot. I, I... <laughs> Although Optimus Prime did die for your sins. I might still be confusing him with Jesus. Yeah, yeah I think you are. Uh, Arizor. That would make Megatron the devil. Fight. Are we sure he's not? Well, now I don't know. <laughs> exactly. Yes, this is very DBZ Budokai esque. Maximals. Maximals. Fight. 
Was this an actual cart? Was this an actual cartoon? Yes. Uh, Transformers. You can watch the entire Beast Wars Transmetals. Yes. You can watch the entire series on Tubi. Cool. Of course, of course you can. I'll get right on that. Also, all the other Transformers shows too. Even the original 80s cartoon. Yep. Vehicle mode, maximize. Intergon Island. I'm facing the pterosaur. Oh no, I'm scared. Fight. I'm skizzity skizzity scared. You scared? Oh my, you scared, damn boy. Boom. Boom. Good work, Maximals. You win as that turned into a pterodactyl for some strange reason. The motherfucking pterodactyl. Yeah, that's it. The motherfucking terror. Or pterosaur, rather. <laughs> <laughs> ha! Good work, Maximilian. Good work, Maximilian. Giant Cave of Darkness. So we're fighting inside Rosie O'Donnell. Oh, dear. Where's Billy to go? Fight. There he is. <laughs> Look, we're inside of her. Look at all the... In the background, it's all her v vaginal teeth. <laughs> what it looks like. That's why she can't keep a woman. She keeps biting their fingers off. Good work, Maximals. I think I'm going to throw up. Good work, Danimals. Yahi, 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 <laughs> my yahi, my yahi, my yaha. <laughs> All things considering, this game right here is actually better than the than the other. Um, uh, Beast Wars game that came out. Good work, Maximals. This is actually a rare game. It's hard to find. Breaking through the line of defense. Waspinator. Waspinator. <sighs> Ready. Fight. I werewolves of London. 
Who's funny because Waspinator died in the TV series. So this game is more based on the toys than the actual show. I love that I hit him and he goes, I Werewolves of London. Fight. Ah, I really hope when I die. Ow. I really hope that when I die, Leonard Skinner doesn't rip off my song. But if that happens, I hope Kid Rock doesn't rip it off again. Aw, <laughs> <laughs> oh, shit. I hope you young oh. will remember. Southern man don't need him around anyhow. Sweet home Algeria. <laughs> Where there ain't Where nothing they? but sand. Where the skies are, uh, I, I guess they're blue. I don't know. Where the blue. sun beats down and kills you. I assume. Sweet home. Situation. <laughs> Pakistan. <laughs> Final Where battle. they all go. <laughs> <laughs> really? <laughs> <laughs> Sweet home Lebanon. <laughs> Sweet Where home. The women are hot. Where the women are hot and they got good food. <sighs> okay. Sweet home Bosnia and Herzegovina. <laughs> where... I wish I knew where that was. <laughs> <laughs> where people just go, who? <laughs> I don't know. Where do people go? <laughs> people in Bosnia and Herzegovina are throwing up everything. <laughs> sure. Yeah, because they gotta live in Bosnia. I mean, <laughs> sweet home Sarajevo. <laughs> Where people are blown to bits. <laughs> Even their sweet, tits. Sweet home Sarajevo. <laughs> Lord, I'm coming home to poo. Oh, I'm coming with the shits. <laughs> All their food gives me the shits. Da -na 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 -na. <laughs> home, Biafra. I at the radio. They always play the same Leonard Skinner songs over and over again, and yep. I'm like. I mean, there are, you know, a lot of the, if you go with their other, their non, their songs that weren't played on the radio or are rarely played on the radio ever, they're a lot better than those songs. I guess. I will it say. seems like a lot of the deep, deep cuts are usually better. Yeah, I will say Warren Zevon, if he was alive, he'd be a kajillionaire. It's true. Yeah, yeah. Not only did my song get ripped off, but the ripoff got ripped off. <laughs> Isn't that crazy? Because Kid Rock has zero imagination or personality. His personality well, is, he... I'm a trailer park man. <laughs> well, I mean, American Badass is just Undertaker. Metallica's song. No, Metallica's song. Oh. <laughs> That's true. Sad but true. Oh, shit. That's what it is. That's the song. It is. Final, final boss. Sad but from the, he just when I heard that song for the first time, you know, Kid Rocks, I said, "This is sad but true." It is. <laughs> it's that it's ripping yeah. off Metallica. It's sad but true that it rips off Metallica. Yes. Yes. And I can remember. A lot of the kids when I went to high school who never listened to Metallica and then they heard Kid Rock, they're like, this song's great. I said, you know, he's using Metallica's music. And they're like, uh-oh. And then I put the Black Album in and I played it. I said, this is a full 10 years before this song. <laughs> they were like, And then their heads oh, exploded. I lost, and then their heads exploded. I oh, lost scanners. And of course, they were like, no. No, I went, yes, yes. 
And my music teacher said, uh, yeah, William's right. Because <laughs> he's too proper to call you Billy. <laughs> well, they called me William in high school. Yeah. That's, that's okay. In high school, I was just called fag. <laughs> <laughs> it's true. <laughs> <laughs> Okay. <laughs> thoughts, on, thoughts on Transformers. It would be weird if the teachers even did that, right? The thoughts on yeah, Transformers, good... Beast Wars, Trans Metal stain. <laughs> you, you stunned me there. <laughs> <laughs> um. Yeah, this was this was actually pretty cool. I I enjoy a good beat 'em up, good fighting game. And when you add in Transformers, I mean, would have been nice if we had uh, the actual OG Transformers, but this one, this one was okay. Yeah, that's that'd be cool, even as like unlockable characters, because I know this is based off a specific series. But uh, Billy, <laughs> Billy, uh, Billy, I liked it. I was really into Beast Wars when I was a kid. Um, I had a lot of the toys. Um, I did enjoy some of the video games. But yeah, I really would have liked them to have made hint to the hint if anybody's hearing this from the video game development world, a Transformers fighting game. That would be really fun. You should do that. Yeah, uh you know, I I I, I said I was curious about this game when I first saw it on the wheel and now that I have played it, I can say uh, without a doubt, a hidden gem on the N64. Um, yeah. Never, w I never would have thought to put Transformers in, uh, into a fighting game like this in a DBZ Budokai style game, but uh, or Tenkaichi. But um, yeah, it actually works very well. I I, I like it, and I think uh, it, I think it's a shame it's uh, as overlooked as it is. Scores out of ten, Dane. Nine. Billy. Nine. Yeah, I'll give it a nine. Uh, on this episode, we played WCW Mayhem, Chef's Love Shack, and Transformers Beast Wars Transmetals. What's the best game of the episode, Dane? Beast Wars. The, uh, Billy? Beast Wars. Yeah, Beast Wars. It's the winner. If you like what we do, please hit subscribe. Be sure to hit the bell to be notified of upcoming videos. For Dane Forgione and Billy Carter, I'm Mike Riley saying see you next time. <laughs>